What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Kid Vision and we are back with a surprise reaction. Social media went crazy. This dropped half an hour ago. Surprise by Kendrick Lamar. I was going to make a video about his announcement for the Super Bowl, so maybe I'll touch on that a little bit. To quickly summarize, I think people need to give Kendrick his flowers and let him have his moment and stop bitching about Lil Wayne, bro. We all know Lil Wayne is a legend. And, like, it would make a lot of sense for him to perform at the Super Bowl because it's his hometown, but it is what it is, and it didn't happen, and, like, Lil Wayne doesn't show up to most of his shows, and he also needs to Google his lyrics, so I don't know why people think he would be a perfect fit for the Super Bowl, like, his own show. Like, I could understand, like, a guest feature, but, like, he doesn't even have, like, clean songs he could do. How to Love is, like, a really cool one he could do, but, like, Kendrick, just let him have his flowers, alright? But anyway, next topic. This is called Watch the Party Die. He only released it on his Instagram, which I find really really weird um because it's official but it's not really official I, I don't know um the album art is literally just black air force ones and i'm not sure if those are his or if he's getting more stuff from drake <laughs> like i don't know what the story is behind that and it is way too early on for like lyric genius to help me with any of this i, I guess i can read you guys what it's about well here all right it just says it came out today, half an hour ago, uh, and it's his first single since Not Like Us. So, like, literally nothing. I'm going to keep the whole Super Bowl Lil Wayne controversy in the back of my mind because that would be kind of cool if he addressed that. Um, and obviously, I'm going to pay attention to, like, any subliminals towards Drake, which I'm sure, like, I just can't see this song not talking about something like that. But before we get started, like, subscribe, comment something I missed. I know I will miss stuff, guys. Do not get angry. Don't get mad. Simply comment below something I missed so others can learn as well. <laughs> but anyway, let's go. I have to go to Instagram and then hit play. This feels really weird, but let's go. Bruh, I have to stay on the tab. Okay. This is so stupid. We're moving this over to my second monitor. There. That works. Let's go. I'll just have it pulled up like this, because I'm sure you guys want to read the lyrics over again. As I, I am. It's time to watch the party die. The shit done got too wicked to apologize. It's different, get them whacked and disqualified. We even kill the killers because they like taking innocent lives. Burn a whole village, we start over. It's really that time. Holy Why shit. reason with these niggas if they can't see the future first? Why argue with these clowns if the circus is well at work? Just walk that man down, that'll do everyone a solid. It's love, but tough love sometimes gotta result in violence. If you parade in gluttony, what? Right off the bat, he is not fucking around. <laughs> he. This is still in, like, diss mode, it feels like. The first thing that comes to my mind is this instrumental sounds like something Action Bronson would rap over. Tell me I'm wrong, bro. What song is that? Is that Jaguar? Wait, hold on. No, 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 no. Not Jaguar. Not Jaguar. I found it. It's this. Estaciones. I don't know why it reminded me of that. Anyway, that's not even important. So he's like reflecting on the beef maybe. And he's just saying like that got way too out of hand and now things are different. Yeah, like burn the whole village. Start over, you know, like go hard as hell. Like diss him as hard as I can without any thought of like backlash. Just so we can like start fresh, like get it out of our systems. And I feel like this on my YouTube channel all the time. Why am I arguing with haters in the comments? You know, like fuck them. <laughs> like, but yeah, so I mean, he's addressing the beef. All right, let's keep going. I'm not even going to rewind it to, like, re-listen to it because it's just this stupid Instagram video, so there's no, like, rewinding in the browser, I don't think. Aviard is company, just tell us what cats get the truth. Say party more than bitches, tell me what are you working for? They glorify scamming, you get chipped over this credit card. Influencers talk down because I'm not with the basic shit. But they don't hate me, they hate the man that I represent. The type of man that never did ride because I want a favor. The man that resides in patience. So where the soldiers at? The ones that lost oh it all. God. 
learn to learn from that A thirst for life Head inside a book Cause he concerned with that Information that'll change his life Because he yearns for that Dedication Finding out what's right Cause he can earn from that There's so much going on here You would think he would give some context To who they are Like up here Like before he references them But he doesn't really So they party more Is he just talking about like other rappers that he kind of like despises or doesn't like they glorify scamming but then this is like that debunks that so he's just like touching on how his art and like him as an artist is different than he is in his personal life i feel for the women that deal with the clown and nerd shit can't blame them today they ain't really got much to work with how many bitches harder than a lot of you niggas will trade harley y'all for nip i can't be proud of you niggas damn god, give me life dear god please give me peace dear god please keep these lame niggas away from me dear so i figured out what happened kendrick literally broke lyric genius it's broken he literally broke the website but he said how many bitches harder than a would trade all of you for nip i can't be proud of you i think he's just talking about like everyone who was involved in the beef and like were there other people like dissing kendrick it, it seems like everyone teamed up on drake so i don't know who he has a problem with here remember that leak kendrick had it was the song is called the prayer and he like personified all of these icons in history, like their art, he personified their art. So like he was speaking in the perspective of Michael Jackson's songs, which is crazy. Like if he's doing some of that, if he's pulling that shit here, like I'm not going to catch everything, bro. If you didn't get that reference though, go listen to The Prayer by Kendrick Lamar. It's amazing. He talks about Martin Luther King and Michael Jackson, and like, it's, that is like a masterpiece, bro. All right, let's go on. Let's listen to the chorus. Keep me shining, the fuck do they really think? Pocket watching, you must be the police. God bless these words, dear God bless how I think. Dear God, draw the line, they trying to confuse them with me. Dear God, please forgive me, you knowing how hard I tried. I think it's time for me to watch the party die. Damn. So Get watch the party die? The party Does he mean die. like, hold on. I feel like watch the party die just means like, I'm done with this shit. I'm done with all the games and the disses and like, it's probably been eating at him. Like that's all that people have talked about all year. Like I personally hear this shit all the time. Think about how he feels. Oh my goodness. All right, I'm going to assume that's what he's talking about. Is him in reference to Drake? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Because if it is, there, he's just saying, like, everyone's getting tied up in the beef. And, and confusing things Drake said with what Kendrick said, like, he said that. Send him home, we go watch the party die. Cool. See, he's clearly, like, writing this in anger. Or, just, not anger, um... He's fed up. I think it's time to watch the party die. Street niggas and the corporate guys, the rappers that report the lies. I need their families mortified. We can do life without them, get their bodies organized. Tell me if you oblige. No more pillow talking, jump starting neighborhood wars. Dirty macking bitches because your spirit is insecure. The flashy nigga with nasty decisions using money as a backbone. I want his head cracked before he's back home. The radio person. Maybe there is some anger. <laughs> propaganda for salary. Let me know when they turn up as a casualty. I want agony, assault and battery. I see Yo. the new earth filled with beauty. The radio personality pushing propaganda for salary, let me know. Is he talking about academics? Possibly. Making humanity work. Let's kill the followers that follow up on popping mollies from the obvious degenerates that's failing to acknowledge the hope that we trying to spread. If I'm not his vote, then you need to bring his fucking head or film that shit in high res. God, give me life. Dear God, please give me peace. Dear God, please keep these lame niggas away from me. Dear God, keep me shining. The fuck do they really think? Wow. Pocket watching, you must be the police. God bless these words, dear God bless how I think Dear God, draw the line, they trying to confuse them with me Dear God, please forgive me, you knowing how hard I tried I think it's time for me to watch the party die Sometimes I wonder what Lecrae Hold on, this is like the biggest stretch you'll ever hear But like, I, it was on my mind because I was just watching the VMAs 
and he dropped this as the VMA started. So, like, if he dropped it to be like, watch the party die, like, watch their viewership go down as everyone checks out my song. Like, there's no way that's what he meant, but, like, I see stretches like that all the time online, and they start to make sense the more I think about them. But I just, that was on my mind. I thought I'd say it out loud, all right? What do? Fuck these niggas up or show them just what prayer do. Wait, he just shouted out Lecrae? Yo, I've listened to Lecrae like on and off for like over a decade, like before he got popular. Um, Andy Minio was like also, um, he collabs with Lecrae a lot. And I used to listen to Andy Minio a lot. And that's how I found Lecrae. That's crazy. I didn't even know they knew each other. All of this so far has just been about the fallout of the beef and his thoughts surrounding it. I think that's a good way to summarize this song. Like, obviously, I'm missing a lot of little details, but th but that's the summary of it, so. I want to be empathetic, my heart like D1, but I will... It's time to get these devils out. I want to know what he said there, so bro. Sword. We settle hard disputes today. The ghetto Hollywood divorce. Say hello to your future fate. The coach of bread with carnivores. You let them snack, they eat your face. The signatures is being forged. They wonder why I'm not enthused to drop. The more visible you get, the more your spiritual is tried. It's in the pool to say, I know these artists petrified. The oh my god. They wonder why I'm not enthused to drop. The more visible you get, the more your spiritual is tried. Man, I can't imagine how it is to be Kendrick Lamar. Like, you drop anything and people are on your ass immediately around the whole world. Not just Kendrick, obviously, like other celebrities. How that weighs on your mental, like, I, I can't imagine in result in jail by jezebel the drug the full of lies critical i know my physical is tested all the time i'm pitiful sunk in place soon as i'm questioning my pride i'm seeing ghosts blacking out relapsing one third at a time i spend no feelings that ain't mine i'm in my feelings when i slide i mean a nigga wonder what lecrae would do terrence martin said i'm mentally what is true wait hold on who annotated this because they put a big question mark where lecrae's name was but they got it right up above so like and they annotated it uh, like, you can tell how fresh this is. I never react to anything on Lyric Genius when it's like this fresh. It's kind of crazy. The market with my best regards, I paid your dues. And so what's up if you ain't one of ours, it's bad news. My nigga Jay Estrada said I gotta burn it down to build it up. That confirmation will as fuck. It ain't too many will as us. Locking into what I trust. Looking outside, the kids live tomorrow. Cause today, the party just... Uh. That is a crazy philosophy, bro. That I don't... I don't know if I agree with that. I don't... So, he's basically saying, f fight fire with fire until there's nothing left. And so then you can restart. Is what he's saying. Which is like... Kind of crazy, bro. <laughs> like, I don't know if I agree with that. It's like, burn it all down till there's nothing left so that we can start from scratch and things can be better. I already know there's going to be comment sections filled with Drake fans just saying, this is who you want to perform at the Super Bowl. This is what you said won the beef. Like, oh my god, people are going to be like, this is boring. He's not even rapping. He's just talking over a piano. Like, oh my god, bro. The internet has ruined me. <laughs> Just ruined my opinion on, like, the general public. <laughs> Man, but this is so bizarre that he dropped it right when the VMA started, right on 9-11, right when he announced the Super Bowl performance. Like, there's so much going on. It was just, like, weird timing. Let me know if you guys have any insider information about the timing of it. That's what I'm interested of. What is the point of dropping this now? But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I will always react to anything Kendrick does. He is my favorite artist. Favorite album of all time right there. You can go watch all my other videos regarding the beef. But I react to new music every single Friday. That's what we do on the channel. So definitely sub and hit the notification bell to get all my videos on Friday. And I will see you then. Alright guys, peace.